All right, so we've talked about some of these different analytics roles, and flavors that fall under the broader umbrella. One of the most common comparisons that you'll see being made is this one, business intelligence versus data science. Now, before I go any further, I wanna make one tweak to this, which is reframing the conversation as BI plus data science. The reason I think that's important is that this isn't some sort of head-to-head -head battle. It's not a binary A versus B decision. In fact, what we're seeing is that when you combine components of business intelligence and data science, you can do some pretty incredible things. That said, I do want to break down what a traditional business intelligence role looks like compared to data science in terms of the types of work that you'd be doing, the types of problems you'd solve, and the types of tools you'd use to solve them. So first up on the BI side, you're typically focusing on something called descriptive analytics. It's using data from stuff that's happened already. What happened? Why did it happen? How can we learn from it and get smarter? On the data science side, the questions tend to be a little bit more predictive and prescriptive. So what's going to happen in the future? How can we predict and prepare for it? And on a similar note, BI is often about answering specific known questions. Sales are down, why? Or which products are driving the highest ROI and how can we optimize towards those? Data science often deals with unknowns. Which employees are most likely to churn next month? Which product might a customer purchase next? Now, as far as tools, in the BI world, there's an emphasis on self-service database, analytics, and visualization tools. Tools like Excel, SQL, Power BI, and Tableau. Data scientists tend to use more statistics and programming tools. Tools like Python, R, and open source libraries designed for flexibility and agility. Typically, business intelligence analysts work with static, structured data sources. So these are tabular data sets stored in tables, comprised of rows and columns, or pre-planned relational models. Data scientists also work with structured data, but they also may work with high velocity or unstructured data as well. Stuff like text, audio, images, IoT signals, things that don't fall neatly into a table format or clean numerical values. Now, generally speaking, for a BI analyst, your goal is to identify patterns and trends that help you turn raw data into insight and business outcomes. The goal for a data scientist, generally speaking, is to test hypotheses through experimentation and iteration. And last but not least, your BI deliverables tend to be things like visuals, reports, and interactive dashboards. Whereas data science deliverables tend to be things like algorithms and statistical models. Now, again, remember, this is not set in stone and these are not hard and fast rules. If you wanna take some components of business intelligence and blend them with some components of data science, there should be nothing stopping you from doing that. In fact, as the analytics world continues to evolve, we're seeing these fields blend together more and more. We're seeing BI analysts writing Python code and dealing with unstructured data. We've got data scientists who are building interactive user-facing dashboards. Now, one of the things that we'll talk about quite a bit throughout this course is the importance of choosing your own path. So try not to get caught up with the labels Try to focus on the skills and the techniques you're interested in learning and use those skills to create the right role for you. And our goal here at Maven will be to help you build the skills and create a roadmap to get there.